nice. Oh, sh what's that? What is that thing? I've never seen that before. Whatever it is, I don't like it. To enshrouded, I'm an old guy gaming, and in this episode, we are gonna go rescue the carpenter. And uh, once we get that finished, we will have um got uh rescued all of our craftsmen, our crafts folks, crafts people, crafts women. You know what I'm talking about? Talking about. Okay, so um, and then we have a bunch of quests that they want us to do. Uh, so let's get our full rested bonus. Um, I did uh, a couple things I'll show you real quick before we leave. I set up some more seed beds out here. And so this has strawberries. This has tomatoes. Uh, this has strawberries and this has tomatoes. And this one has corn. Um, but these are seed beds. Duh. <laughs> I was thinking that they grew the actual cross, but they don't. They just grow the seed. So we still have to um, plant them in the ground. And I think, I don't know this for sure, but I think we need a hoe to do that, to till the soil, maybe. Uh, and I don't know how to get a hoe. Um, it's not available to me yet, so we, we're missing something. Uh, well, you know, probably more quests and things that we need to do. I also discovered that I can't make popcorn until I make uh, the fireplace, which is one of the farmer's um, workstations. This, even though this thing here is also called the fireplace, it's not the same, the same fireplace. Um, and I moved her over next to it because I thought maybe she just needed to be near one, but it's a completely different workstation altogether. Uh, all right, so I think that's it. I think we should be in pretty good shape in terms of being ready to go. So let's set on out and go uh, rescue the carpenter, which is gonna be way out to the west here. Um, I did go pick up several more um, flame uh, or sparks. Uh, so we now have enough sparks to do the next flame upgrade, but we need we need the head of, I'm, I'm guessing, a boss, uh, uh, as well as a couple other things. But I've got everything else except for the boss's head. Um, and I think, I'm not sure, but I think, um, let's see, where is that at? Reclaim the wilderness. Oh, yeah, I think it's this test of skill. That we have to do to get the head of that boss in order to do the next upgrade and we need to do that so we can pass through the deadly shroud um you know to get to the next spark so lots of stuff to do uh okay so before we go bailing off the edge of this hill let's get our buff food going all right here we go Um, there, there is a, um, um, a flame altar, uh, not flame altar, you know, where you get the sparks. I can never, I keep forgetting what those things are called. Um, just right, if you just go through that little loop de oh shit, a loop de doop thing there, and then around the corner, it's, it's there. So... Flame Shrine, or, uh, yeah, I don't remember what it's called. Let's get back here and make sure that that is our main quest. So we're heading in the right direction. Um, all right, I guess... I guess we barrel off down here. But let's go ahead and take one of these because you want to take those before you go into the to the shroud and let's do it. Saline quarry. Does that mean there's salt around here too? Maybe. Maybe. 
Okay. Got some bad guys. Oh, I don't want to get next to the fungus fungus thingy. Let's just investigate this really quick. If we look on the map, yeah, it's just a minor POI. But my guess is that we could probably. Oh shit. Okay, hold on. I gotta pay attention here. These guys are. Three of them is a bit much. Got that other guy? Okay. Um, le oh, look at this. Nice. Put that there and melt it down for 56 runes. I think I'll wait to take that because we still have over six minutes. But I want to confirm that this is a place that we can also get salt from because it says saline, so generally means salt. Oh, no, don't get near that damn thing. Uh, what's up here? Another thingy. Well, there's, there's some salt. That guy down there. I hear... Oh yeah, there is salt here. Okay, cool. Alright, so this is maybe just a tad closer to home than the... Uh, you know, than the other mine that we were at. Let's go ahead and take this now. Okay. We need to go this general direction. I need to have um, uh, a come to Jesus meeting with my storage in the base because I'm damn near out of space. So I'm going to do that. Oh, shoot. That's like red shroud there. Uh, I want to do that before I really start collecting a bunch more stuff. How in the hell am I supposed to get over there? Hmm. Maybe I'm not supposed to get over there yet until we upgrade the flame again. Tear out? What's that? Oh, that's just plant fiber. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't uh, look like we are meant to get over there yet. We're so close, too. All right, um, hmm. Well, wait a minute, is that, is that Deadly Shroud or is it just red because of the lava? Um, it might just be red because of the lava. Oh, you know what? I should have used my staff. My healing staff for that instead of a bandage. Not that it, the bandage is hard to make either. I don't know, man. That looks red to me. But it's hard. It's hard to say for sure. There's a root down there. All right, well, I don't want to go down there and then die because then we'll lose all of our stuff. <coughs> Let's look at the map again. Uh, 
Um, I know we can get across over here, because obviously we've been way over that direction. But I'm guessing that this continues on over into that area. Okay, well... Hmm, let's, let's move this direction for a minute. For a hot minute. Oh, it's just a stone. Guess we'll collect some shroud juice. See, again, I just don't know if that's a deadly shroud or if it's just red because of the lava. Um, okay, that's normal shroud. I mean, we can obviously jump over there, but if that's deadly shroud, I'm hosed. You know what I mean? Let's go. Let's move, move this way. What the hell's making that noise? Man, there's there there a lot of the ambient sounds that they play are kind of creepy because it sounds like there's a monster or something nearby. All right, what do we got going on here? All right. Let's just go forward really slowly. And if we see deadly shroud, we got to retreat like super fast. Saline Springs. for us to read this smothered and devoured by obscurity the shroud swallows all even us we became we become lost to dusk vanish and morph in a sea of cornflower stained twilight never have i encountered a sickness a curse of this gravitas the fog burns eyes and lungs but doesn't quite kill it spreads it manipulates it eats away at us slowly leaving only a husk there is no cure for this only the power of the flame can keep the shroud at bay that's us we're the power of the flame okay So maybe this is our way across here. Oh, shit. Rude. I wish I could cancel, you know, the arrow once I pull it back, but I haven't figured out how to do that. Nice. Oh. Get out of here. Is is this a yeah, let's take this. And then let's get away from those exploding barrels. Eh, it's nasty down there. Okay, so we got across. I know I'm guessing too that is there a, a grappling th grappling thingy up there? Oh, that's not a gap that has to be jumped. Never mind. Um, what was I going to say? I don't remember what I was going to say. So never mind. Wasn't important. What's going on over here?
Here's a checkpoint. All right. What's is that guy that's stuck in the ground? What's the deal with him? Looks like maybe he is. Oh, that's a new. That's a new dude, but he. I think he's stuck in that rock. It's like a crawler. Is he? Or is he just... Maybe he is just underground. I don't know. Alright, what the hell? Yeah, he's... He's glitched. He's just glitched in the ground. He's not even taking damage. That's hacks. Alright, let's give ourselves a heal. <coughs> nice. I need to start using that a little more often. Of course, it uh, does use the charges, but eventually we'll be able to make the charges. We just haven't unlocked it yet. Um, all right. Just curious as to what's going on over here. What's going on in this building? There's a bad guy up there. like we break that <laughs> nice another shepherd staff um a campfire I don't want that where did it go it's right here so it's the same as the one no actually this is a level three versus level seven yet so salvage that Bones. <laughs> Excuse me. Kazoom tight. Um. Are we supposed to be able to get up here somehow? There's something up there. Oh, shoot. <laughs> yeah, let's try that again. I, I don't see a. There we go. Nice. Ooh. This is only a level three, though. And this is a level nine. Yeah, there's... So, we would get three more points of damage plus critical plus mana leech. It's got a high rate of fire. So, this is a slow draw speed. But it also has a 7% arrow speed. Well, this does too. Um, I don't... I don't know. I'm not going to melt it right now. Let's think about this later. It's probably not going to uh, you know, reach the raw damage of, of this one. But with that faster draw speed, you know, the DPS could potentially be comparable. We won't really know unless we upgrade it, which we can because I've got a lot of runes now. I mean, I don't want to waste them, but it might be worth checking out anyway. Oh. Well, there's another way to get up here, I suppose. Okay. Okay. Um, so yeah, let's, um, move on over to the Hunter.
What do we got here? Underground mine. Whoops. Not even marked on the map. It looks like a flintstone mine. Okay, yeah. Pretty, pretty sizable one. Huge flintstone mine. Um, I don't see anything down here though, in the way of like loot. So let's head back on up. Yep, the map doesn't doesn't mark that at all. Yeah, I'm guessing that the shroud back there that I thought was deadly was probably just red because of the lava. Because it wouldn't make sense for that to be deadly and this not, since it's even further out, you know? At least that's kind of my, my thought on the matter. So fun to just explore this world. All right, we gotta go get our our carpenter though. Oh, is that a is that a spire? I think that's a spire over there, which we should be able to get to. Nice. Okay, it says the location is below. Cool. Yeah, after we rescue the hunter, we're gonna we're gonna do the spire for sure. Um Let's just go see if we can kind of figure out what the hell's going on here. No, we need to get up there. Also, let's um, let's take one of these to get some health back, and then we need to redo our buffs. There's some corn, but I don't think I'm going to pick that right now. Okay, so let's move this direction. Ouch. Um, stamina. Ooh, I see the desert biome off that way. That's cool. These guys are level seven. Let's give ourselves a square to heal. That's awesome. Um, and then we will take one of these, one of these, and one of these. Let's get this off our toolbar so I don't accidentally eat it and make make ourselves sick here. <laughs> Location below. What's that? Oh, flintstone. Why does it say below? Seems like from the topography, it should be above. Oh, there, uh, oh, that's a fling symptom. And a checkpoint. Nice. Okay, so what is going on here? <clears throat> Maybe we get to that bridge and <coughs> excuse me, cross over. Oh, 
Oops. Oh, wrong toolbar. Dude, change to the right toolbar, please. Thank you. Uh, okay. That's the way to do that. Doesn't really get us anywhere, though. Well, maybe I should just pay attention to what the game is telling me and go down below. What do you think? I think that's a good idea. I think that's a good idea. I don't want to go that way. Oh, now it says the location's above. What the hell? Make up your mind, game. I obviously missed something important. Hmm. Okay. Ah. Now I think I'm picking up what they're putting down, except for not going that way. Shit. Uh. How do we get over there? Up here? Try that again. Oh. Oh shit. I keep accidentally switching to my other toolbar. I remapped my second toolbar onto my mouse and I'm starting to think see that that was a mistake because I'm accidentally bumping it and it's really case in point screwing me up so you know what oh let's not do that let me go back to here here um, I want that off of there uh, wait what no Delete, uh, R, delete, there we go. We'll just keep it back on alt so I don't keep doing that and royally jacking myself up here. Ah, shit, okay, so let's give ourselves a square to heal. And then we'll rebuff because we lost everything. Um, alright. Can we... Is there a better way to get over there? Because the way we went is not technically the correct way. We just made it work, you know? My sword is... running out of durability, too. So... What I might do is set a flame altar down and go home and repair. But let's get to the entrance first. This is the way I should have gone in the first place. But I didn't know. just a bridge. Actually, we came across that bridge because we were up in that tower earlier. Okay. Looks like there's a little village over there or something. 
Let's go discover it. So at least it's on the map. I don't think we have a time limit to get back to our stuff, do we? I've never noticed that. Morwina. Morwina. Nice. Healing channels. Well, with our track record for today, yeah, it's going to come in handy. Alright, do I have enough stuff to make a altar? I do. Okay. So let's just pop the sucker down right here. Alright, I'll meet you guys back here after I go get uh, all fixed up. Well, actually, should we go get our stuff first? Why don't we? Yeah. That way I can... I can drop it off. I hear a bad guy, I just don't see him. Oh, look how close we were to that spawn point, too. Oh man, that sucks. <laughs> oh well. Ooh, look at that. Belly surfing. All right, guys, while we're here, um, I'm going to go ahead and upgrade this legendary bow that we have um, and see if it's worth doing. Okay, so now if we do a, a comparison... This has five more just straight up damage, but this has a faster draw speed. It has uh, precise as does that, so that they're the same. Mana leech on hit leech, 5% damage as mana. So that uh, does that mean it takes. 5% of the damage I did and turn it into mana? Hmm. That's not all that useful, if that's what that means, because we're not, um, you know, we're not a caster. So really, increased critical hit chance by 20%. Yeah, I, I still think this is probably the overall the better bow. Um, I really do. So, I'm I'm not going to melt it just quite yet, though. I might hang on to it. <coughs> <coughs> Damn it. Excuse me. I might hang on to it for a little bit. Maybe as a backup or something. I don't know. But, yeah, I, I think... I, I don't think that was worth doing. But, I, you know, you, you don't know unless you try, right? So... That's just the way it goes sometimes. I'm going to replenish my potions here. And, um... Only have those two. Oh, um... I don't know how that got out of my inventory. Alright, we'll put the runes back in here. Or back in here, wherever I pulled them out of. And I think we're ready to to set off. We got full rested bonus. Let's do it. You know what I'm uh what I might do though is let's put this on our toolbar and let's just try it and see how I like the feel of the the faster speed. Buff up too. Um. Okay. Where'd that come from? Oh, 
He's aiming at a different guy. Yeah, it's a, definitely a little bit faster. I, I, I like the feel of this one better, though. Okay, are we gonna... Hmm, is this whole place in the shroud? Maybe we better pop back out and take in a, a potion. Okay. Let's give ourselves a heal squirt. And take one of these. Make sure it fills all the way up. Okay. Stay away from those puffball thingies. Yeah, I, d I definitely like the feel of the wolf bow better than the other one. But that could just be because I'm more used to it. Alright. Yuck. Yuck oh yuck. In this place. We got bugs down there. shit ton of bugs down there. Um, I don't see any way to get out of there. Try and pick a couple of them off with our bow. What's that? What is that thing? I've never seen that before. I don't like it. Whatever it is, I don't like it. I wish the game would tell you what the names of these monsters were. Those are like seeking thingies. So it's kind of like a banshee or something, huh? Wow. Okay. Let's break that thingy. That's scary. That's some scary shit, man. Oh, we got a shroud core from killing her. Oh, boop, 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 boop. Greater mana potion. Um, okay, so we do need to be mindful of our shroud timer. Flame sanctum. Really? Where's the flame? I'm going to move this back up here because it's just really handy for... Oh, not that. Stop it! For taking out stuff like this without expending ammo. Alright. 
Why does it say that there's a flame sanctum here? Sneaky. A rusty sword. Okay. Yeah, there's one right there. Okay, good. Up we go. All right, because time is of the essence. Oh, shit. Well, there we go. Fired brick at kiln. Kate Hawthorne, the carpenter. Beautiful. Okay. Um, what's going on in here? Just a way to get out of here, maybe. I'm looking to see if there's any. A chest down there. Wait a minute, though. Isn't this the room we just moved through? I don't see a grappling hook spot. Hmm. Okay, well, we can't stay here forever. Nice, okay. I think that chest that I saw down there was the one we looted earlier where we found the rusty sword. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is it for the carpenter. Okay. So, I'm going to pick this up. I'm going to uh, take it over to the spire uh, that's up that way. And then we're going to do that spire uh, because we're here. But obviously we're going to have to do that in the next episode because we are out of time. So thanks everybody for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. And if you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment to share the video and we'll catch you all in the next episode. Bye-bye.